Well, this next story involves one lady and two jobs where you wouldn't want to see them cross paths. 53-year-old Elizabeth Kendall Ritchies works for the Canterbury District Health Board but has just returned to New Zealand from Australia after appearing as a zombie for an upcoming film, ticking off the opportunity of her bucket list. She's just a friendly project administrator at the CDHB, but last week Elizabeth Kendall Richards was the exact opposite, applying to be an extra in the Australian zombie film The Last Hope. It was just so professional. Um, I did have this horrible feeling. I was travelling all the way to Melbourne and it was going to be appalling. But actually, they had 25 makeup artists, they had lights, they had drones, they had three or four cameras, they had PAs, they had food. Only hearing about the opportunity from an overseas friend, Elizabeth applied and thought she had no chance of getting one of the roles. Well, there was several extra zombies. There's tier one, which was at the beginning, at the front of the camera. So we had the most makeup. It was sort of 30 for tier one, and the rest went through. But it was very, very exciting. And the paycheck for being one of the most decorated zombies? Didn't get paid for it, I paid for it myself. It was a bucket list that wasn't on my bucket list. And so I thought, no, if you're going to do it, do it properly. And I won't regret spending the money. The passion goes back 35 years when Mrs. Kendall Richards started watching zombie films. Now she'll be watching herself on the big screen. And it's safe to say Elizabeth's zombie acting is scarily good. Sam Pickering, CTV News.